Hello, here's a quick video on how to create DVAR correctly on Samsara. Um, once you have opened your app, you added your truck and your trailers. Um, you always want to go and check on your uh, clocks. Make sure you have your clocks uh, up to par. Make sure you have your time before you start your day. Uh, during the week, 10 hours off. Uh, in the weekend, make sure you, when you come back on your Monday that it is 34 hours uh, to reset your clocks that way you don't have any issues during the week um, so therefore let's go to um, on duty we're going to be creating a DVIR on the pre-trip um, and then we're going to hit save now it's time to create a DVIR because uh, we're doing an inspection on, on the truck you have two the truck or the trailers so let's go to the truck first make sure that the location is there if not just add it uh, we're going to hit pre-trip and as you hit pre-trip you can start walking around the truck open your hood check your oil check all your fluids your brakes tires make sure everything's up to par each company is different on what they require you to do the pre-trip on so just go uh, just do it as what the company expects you and needs you to do uh, for your uh, equipment once that's done if there's any issues you can take pictures or add defects and as you can see this one has a, a few of them um, for training purposes and then you can do it by adding you can pick on what it is batteries belt hoses uh, whatever is wrong with it and if you can't find it in here just push other and then take a picture of what the other is add a comment and on here um, you can put down exactly what's wrong and if you want you can even put down where it's at and Give a quick description of what your problem is. <clears throat> Once you've done that, push done. If it's safe to drive, safe to drive. Next, certify and submit it. Once you certify and submit it, you're good to go on the truck. Let's do let's do one now for the trailers. Create DVIR again. You're gonna click on the trailers, and on this one doesn't have a location, so we're gonna you're gonna add it on here. Add the location wherever it's at, uh, at the front yard, backyard, Port of New, New York, wherever it's at. Pre-trip it, start walking around your trailer, make sure all your lights are working properly, make sure your tires are up to par and no flat spots, no wires showing, um, the, the, the normal uh, pre-trip. If there's anything going on with the trailer, choose uh, whatever, where it's at, take a picture of it, Again, if there's any defects, add a defect. If there's not in the list, you can hit other at the bottom and then you can describe of what it is that it's wrong. With the trailer, if there's nothing wrong with it, then all we're gonna do is go to safe to drive. Next, certify and submit. And the reason why we wanna do it this way is that way we have to have the app open is because it's gonna document the actual time that it's taking you to do the pre-trip. Um, the CHP DOT requires us, or FMCSA uh, requires us to do a 15 minute pre trip um, and a 15 minute post trip. So let's work on doing that. Uh, take your time and and let's, let's do it right the first time. That way we don't have any issues when they go to the scale and they're asking us where's our pre trips and if, why are they not done. So let's make sure we're doing them every day. For every piece of equipment, we want to make sure that we are doing a DVIR. Once you drop off that piece of equipment, you do a post trip, safe to drive. If it's safe to drive, certify and submit. When you uh, then you you go on here, and you want to delete this piece of equipment, and then add the next trailer or the next uh, whatever it is that you're hooking up to. So every piece of equipment that you touch. It needs to be uh, a, there has to be a DVAR created for it, pre-trip and post-trip. So when you pick it up and you drop it off and then your vehicle will in the morning and then in the afternoon when, you, when you're done, do a post-trip DVAR. Um, so this is how you do one. Guys, hopefully this works and helped you guys out. If you have any questions, um, feel free to leave a comment. If you haven't subscribed, subscribe and then uh, I can make more videos or let me know what you guys are wanting me to make a video about um, I can help you guys out thanks for watching
Right.